City's EDS kicked off their European adventure in style this week as they returned from Germany with all three points after beating 10-man Bayern 4-1. Angus Gunn began in goal with Angelino, Adarabayo, Maffeo and Bossarts as the back four. Dubliner Jack Byrne started in midfield alongside captain Kian Bryan, with Frenchman Olivier Inchem pulling the strings to feed the three-pronged attack of Barker, Pozo and Ambrose. City's last visit to Munich was a nervy affair, with a goalless draw enough for Vieira's men to qualify for the last 16. And in the opening exchanges, this was no different Gunn with a good save early on. The visitors though would take the lead on 26 minutes with a well taken strike. Angelino found room on the left and when Ambrose rose highest to knock down for Burn, the midfielder showed quickness of feet to finish nicely past the onrushing keeper. Bayern did settle after going behind and again, it took another good save from Gunn to deny the hosts. The match then took a turn for the worse for Bayern on 35 minutes. Angelino's long ball caused a defensive mix-up, with Huntermark deliberately handling the ball outside the box. The referee had no choice but to show the goalkeeper red. Unfortunately for substitute keeper Fish Harbour, his first task was to pick the ball out of the net. Angelino with the defence splitting pass to Pozo, who threw two dummies before calmly slotting home. Having already shipped six past the Germans in last year's UEFA Youth League group stage, it looked as if City were going to inflict the same again in the second half. Angelino with the deserved finish from Barker's through ball on the hour mark. Recently capped Kosovan international Bursan Selina replaced Byrne on 62 minutes and with virtually his first touch, he made it 4-0. The forward finding the net, the second time of asking for his third of the season. It was nearly five for Vieira's men, but Ambrose headed against the bar from close range. Credit to the Germans, they didn't stop going forward and in the second minute of extra time, they scored a consolation through Walter. Roma are up next for City on the 30th of September, with the Italians brushing aside CSKA 3-1 in their opening game. Full time from Munich, Bayern 1, City 4. Patrick, a fantastic afternoon here in Munich. What are your thoughts on the game? Yeah, fantastic afternoon. I think when you come to a place like Munich, it's, uh, it's never easy. But I was quite really pleased today because we show um, a really good team spirit. We show uh, a really good togetherness. We went through, uh, especially the first half, I think uh, 20 minutes where we really struggled. But we didn't concede the goal and, uh, and I'm quite really pleased because the players stick together. and. Uh, and we let that difficult period going through and, uh, and then after I think we, we, managed, we managed the game and, um, and the best team uh, won the game. I thought we were going through a little bit of a bad spell around the 20 minute mark and then we got the goal and I thought it settled us down really nicely. And um, as you can see we kicked on from there and we were delighted to get the 4-1 win. Well as you say when you got that goal that just seemed to spark the game into life. Talk us through it. Um, well, it was a great header from Thierry, so I think he deserves most of the credit, to be fair, because it was whipped to the back post. I was just in the right place at the right time and just tapped it in, to be honest. At one point, in the way they were getting the goals, I thought it was almost going to be a repeat of the 6-0 from last year. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because I think our, our strengths going forward was really good. Uh, Pozo, Thierry and Brennan had, uh, had a fantastic game, and every time we went behind the back four, um, it was a threat. So uh, we created so many chances, we scored four. It was a good afternoon. The win will help us now going forward because the first game is always difficult and the belief side of it, if you can believe that you can go and win the tournament, I think this game will show us that we can. And we, because last year we came here and was a hard fought 0 nil, nil draw and um, with the eight games coming up I thought they were brilliant, I thought Tosin at the back did very well. So um, yeah, it's great.